Welcome back to Opalaka, the plot where I conduct experiments on different ideas I have in Meet Your Maker. Today, I wanted to share with you the DMS roadblock from a setup in my base, Willits. I wanted to show off this specific trap setup because it's a versatile setup that can deal with both players who go quickly and players who have a more turtle or slow playstyle. Dragon's Breath, Flamethrowers, and Pistons are a staple in slowing raiders down in your bases. But this adds a spin to it that allows it to also be a threat to people who play a slower. This setup utilizes four key things. A line of opaque corrosive cubes to block vision of what's going on. A DMS cannon which launches a guard with the add-on dead man switch at a player. This staple flamethrower piston setup to slow down fast raiders and a normally fairly useless flamethrower add-on called an eruption which will explode around the flame trap as it finishes expelling flames. The property of eruption that makes all of this work is that it can destroy hollow cubes on blocks directly next to it. This works in tandem with a DMS warmonger hidden inside a hollow cube and a piston that will only activate once the hollow cube blocking it has been removed. This will subsequently launch the guard through the corrosive cubes and directly onto the raider. An important thing to note when using this setup, or DMS cannon setups in general, is the closer you can get the guard to the center of the block it's going to be launched from, the more reliably the cannon will fire. And that's all for the DMS roadblock. If you have any other questions or concerns about Meet Your Maker, about the setup, or in general, please feel free to co uh, comment them down below. And thank you for watching. Subscribe if you want to see more of these. And I'll see you later. Bye-bye.